Hey guys, so today I want to talk about an issue that I feel uh, is becoming a really big problem in our society, and I feel like nobody's really uh, talking about it or, or coming up with any kind of solution, and that uh, problem is the theft, uh, the, the ongoing theft issues that we seem to be having in our uh, retail stores. Um, and, you know, it, I gotta say, it really upsets me, uh, the fact that, sh that some people, I mean, we're talking, like, from, you know, teenagers to uh, middle-aged uh, men and women that come in, and they just, you know, they, they take, uh, they, they grab whatever they want, and they just take off with them. Uh, they come in, like, they own it, like, they own the place, and they just, uh, you know, have this entitlement, and they just... They just, uh, you know, do it, and they get away with it, and there's no, uh, you know, repercussions or, you know, consequences or, or anything like that. At least that's what it seems. Um, and I got to say, I'm just blown away by it, uh, just how much it's growing, and, and not just, uh, you know, in the in the state of uh, Washington, but many other states as well. Um, I'm definitely not the smartest guy uh, in the world uh, by any means. Uh, I do not, um, you know, I, I don't always know uh, what is, you know, exactly going on in our society, but, you know, I am in a position now that I, I see, uh, I see people every day, I walk with people every day, and I just see what goes on, and, and um, you know, I gotta say, it's, it's just huge, it's a huge disrespect to the men and women that work hard every day and you know they they you know they they struggle but they get up every day they they get ready they take care of their uh families and, and kids and they come in and they go shopping and all of that and they pay and they you know they 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 pay the money that they worked hard to do and and then, you know, then you have these other people that, um, again, just, you know, come in like they own the place and they just, uh, they just grab whatever they want and off they go. And, um, it's like, man, you know, I, I know that, um, I'm sure that, you know, law enforcement is, is, is doing the best they can. We're trying to keep up with everything. Um, you know, I know they can't be everywhere and I know that, that, you know, they, they're not gonna, you know, they're not gonna get everybody, but, um, <coughs> man, I just, I mean, the, uh, you know, just the, the policies and all that stuff that's going on, well, you know, we're not allowed to, amp, uh, you know, physically stop them or, or anything, uh, anything like that, it just kind of, you know, really bugs me, and I get it that, um, and I get that, uh, you know, it's a safety thing. And, you know, some of the people that come in, I mean, they're, you know, without a doubt, I mean, they're, they're dangerous people. They're, they're criminals. I mean, they're, I'm not going to, you know, sugarcoat uh, anything. And, and, and I know that, you know, we are definitely um, at risk for, you know, to get uh, really hurt. And, uh, and I, I get that part. But it, it just... I don't know. Something has to has to happen. Um, you know, I mean, nobody has the right to uh, do that. You know, to just uh, you know, I mean, I I don't know. I mean, the last time I thought about how I was raised, I was raised to, you know, you don't steal. That's not what you do. You pay uh, for you know what you what you want. You you pay for it. Um, what you want in life, you, you, you pay for it. You work hard and you pay for it. And that's just, you know, how I, you know, how I was, uh, brought up. And, and I know a lot of other people, uh, you know, all, all that way too. Um, and I also understand that there's a lot of people that are good people, but they are going through a massive amount of, uh, hard, hardships. And, uh, you know, they're struggling and they just don't, they are at the bottom and they are just, I mean, they're, they just cannot get any more further, um, 
to the ground than than they already are uh, in life, and I and I get that. But you know, stealing is stealing, and you can't just uh, that that's just not okay. And um, I got to tell you, I think that you know, if things continue the way that they do, uh, the the future of retail uh, is in grave danger. I mean, it, it's insane. I. Uh, there was uh, uh, there's been some uh, stores, there's been some WalMarts that uh, that have uh, closed. Uh, I think over in Portland, if I'm remembering uh, correctly, uh, those things, uh, you know, uh, like Target and Best Buy, I have heard that have made the decisions to stop uh, selling uh, movies. Um, and they have, and not only that, but they now have a lot of things uh, locked up now um, in, uh, you know, like in, in Target and stuff like that. In fact, I I was at a, I went over to Target a few, a few weeks ago, and um, I, yeah, there was no, no movies um, at, at all. Um, and, um, you know, and, and then the other things, a lot of other things were uh, locked up. And I remember I asked this uh, guy, uh, this one of the Target employees, I asked him if, uh, you know, if, if, you know, maybe he knew why uh, they had stopped, uh, that there was no more movies. And he said, and he just kind of had this, this kind of... Um, I mean, the way he said it was that, well, because people keep tell people keep stealing them, and then they, you know he he was just like take care, and then just walked away. But I kind of felt like he got a little bit aggressive, um, and he kind of um, looked at me as if I was part uh, <coughs> that I was part of the of the problem, which is another. Uh, thing that I feel has been happening is that when I go out and I go shopping, uh, I basically get tweeted and look like and, and looked at um, as a as a suspect, and um, you know the entire time I'm in the uh, in the store. So uh, there was there was that, and, um, and and I get it. You know you can buy everything on online now. You can get everything on Amazon and all that stuff. I mean you can make it to the point where uh, I mean you know where you don't go shopping uh, at all. You know uh, my you know my dad. You know he. He doesn't go out shopping uh, at all, like ever. Um, he um, he now he just you know goes shopping online uh, on Amazon. In fact, I, I don't even. I think the last time he was at a store was like in I don't even know, like nineteen sixty two or something like that. But anyway, um, and so um, yeah, it, it it's just. It's devastating, and I gotta say, it's just heartbreaking. And I, I don't know what's gonna happen uh, if we if things keep running the way that they are. But it, it's it's not good. That's all I gotta say. It's it, it's just not good. I mean, it, and the, you know, like for myself, I enjoy going, getting out of the house, and going shopping at a store, even if I don't buy anything. I just, it's just a simple fact to me, getting out of the house, going into a, you know, uh, a mall or outlet mall or, or just, you know, a window shop um, or, you know, just being out. So it's a little bit more than just shopping. You just, you know, it's, it's an opportunity to, you know, to, to be out of the house, you know. Um, so that's what, for me, that's what I like, I uh, I like to do uh, sometimes, um, but man, I gotta tell you, it's uh, running out. I mean, I I don't know if I, um, you know, want to do shopping like physically, like go out and and shop uh, anymore. You know, I mean, I I've, I've kind of, you know, thinking that I maybe should uh, switch to just shopping online now. You know, I just. 
and I don't want, really want to do that because I like going out. Uh, but uh, yeah, we gotta we gotta do something. I don't know what we gotta have like a <clears throat> like a city council meeting about it, or we gotta have a some type of a community community um, discussion or something. And, you know, let me know what you what you think um, needs to happen, and and you know, just I don't know. I mean, let's try to come up with a solution or what what we think needs to what you think needs to happen because yeah, I mean it it's upsetting, and uh, you know, I get I get comments, you know, like oh, you know, what are you gonna do? You know, what are you gonna do? Uh, uh, want him over, or, or you know, oh, oh, you know, how are you gonna stop him? Or, or, or oh, well, there's there's nothing that you can do. You know, once they, you know, they're out, then they're out, or something like that. It's like, you know, that is just not, <laughs> that is just not okay. It just is not okay. But um, yeah, um, you know, I, 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 as far as in the meantime, um, uh, I mean. It is what it is, and there really isn't uh, anything that could be uh, done until the community uh, and law enforcement really steps up, and uh, whoever's making the laws, uh, you know, starts to uh, hold people accountable uh, for their their actions. Uh, because uh, me, if me and you gotta pay. You know, go go shopping and pay for what we you know want to want to get. Then uh, I you know everybody has to do it. You know, so yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching.